what was once the dream gym looks like a trash can. We got dumbbell residue, like a few boxes, some micro plates, and this one gold mine right there, that lap pull down. Here's the situation with this. This thing's extremely tall, and there's two different heights in the basement, and this obviously has to go in the taller one, and it's just barely gonna be able to fit, but we're gonna have to disassemble this entire thing piece by piece, bring it down, and then remember how we disassembled it and reassemble it down there. And it's extra hard to cut. <laughs> You're saying this like we're like about to just bring the trash can from like where the trash can stands to like the front. Like, dude, this shit's literally rocket science. It kind of is rocket science no, because it came it came fully assembled. So seriously, think about it. Like, actually, like we it's <laughs> like literally like there's so many moving parts to that. Like, look, all this shit can get all fucked, and then there's like these little nut bolts and fucking there's weird pulleys that get out of whack. And then there's fucking 300 pounds of weight that has to be carried down. And then there's fucking like just big long pieces of scary equipment. Can this be taken apart and reassembled? Like is it actually? I don't realistic? see why it couldn't. I mean like is it? It really has to have been. There's no way like it just came out of the womb looking like this. Like someone had yeah, to fucking screw machines. all this together. Put it together in a machine. We're more intelligent than machines. Here's what we should do. I think that we should see how many different kinds of bolts there are take out one of each bolts and then go to Ace Harder around the corner and get like fucking one of those drill machines so we can like get this done like ASAP. Like, and then there's little bit notice you have to think about this. Look, then we have to run a pulley line through Mitch. Like it is not simple. Like look, this pulley like runs down the corner. Yes. Look, then it goes somewhere. Like, this is not building a fucking Tesla. It's not the easiest thing in the world, but we can do it. I mean, it is very difficult. Get this down because like the, this all actually this is really heavy. This this is attached to this. We have to take all. Yo, what the it. fuck's all this pestering and doing? We were talking this for the past three days. I, I thought this shit was gonna be easy as fuck until I came in. I looked at it. This shit's a fuck. This is like a Tesla. Like at least we're at least we're filming all of it so we could like reverse engineer. This is the thing you gotta think about putting it back together because like look this pulley system. Like look at all this scary like pulley system shit that goes all over the place. This. Like, you, you can't just aimlessly take it apart, like. Dude, how did you just worry about this thing? I'll just do all the dumbbells. You and Elon Musk, you can't invite Elon over. So we're gonna go to Ace Hardware. We're gonna get one of those drills that has one of these ends on it so we could accelerate our process times like 25. And I'm kind of sad that I'm getting this now after I <laughs> assembled like half my house Dude, because I could have literally been so much more like further ahead like in the future in all realms of life. I just had that drill and I wasn't there with my Amish like wooden tools trying to slowly take pull it easy. everything together. <laughs> Dude, you, we assembled both dumbbell racks two times Squat rack two times and and the lap pull down with absolutely not no drill. That's the most honest thing I've ever. There's an Ace Hardware literally of an eight minute walking distance from your house. Yeah, I'm popping this bitch. What for your porch? Yeah, I got popping this bitch. Nice little coffee right here. Chainsaws. They have chainsaws. Oh, that's right. Should we just get a chainsaw? Oh no, but we should get a chainsaw and just cut a bunch of trees down for fun. I think I should do a chainsaw and get this. Excuse me, ma'am, can I have a coffee table for outside and an XL chainsaw, please? <laughs> Not for any reason specifically. Oh, uh, I found them. I found them. I found them. Yeah, they're here. The, the Hulk edition? Yeah, it's the Mac. Yeah, it's the Mavic Hulk edition. Alpha. It don't work. It don't work here. All right, guys, Dave is finally a drill guy, so everyone comment below and congratulate him on his first drill. It's a big moment for him, man. Big moment. <laughs> Jesus. Dude, this guy was trying to say this shit wasn't strong. This shit could literally kill like- He's like, yeah, it's not as strong as like the 20 volt. Like, it's hard. Dude, it's, it, look, 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 look at my hair. Not 
Dude, is this for real? Is it that weak? And it's broken already. Yeah! We were so intimidated and threatened by that. No, try, try, try the one on the side. <laughs> Alright, keep your skin around. Fuck! Keep your red This is a useless piece of <laughs> Dude. Look, it's stealing, it's fucking stealing. Dude, unplug that bitch. Alright, so we have to return this because it's either heavily defected or just not strong enough to do the job. Either way, we're giving it back. So we returned that drill and then we were consulting the dude that worked there asking like is it the drill's not strong enough or like it's just something wrong? Is there a glitch in the matrix? Like what's going on? And basically we concluded that we're not gonna get a stronger drill. We just got a manual wrench. So now three hours into working, we unscrewed one bolt. So we gotta be a little bit more productive. We disassembled it, so there's bolts lying around everywhere. There's like pieces here, pieces here, and <laughs> we gotta go set up a base right now, like clear up some space so we can find a place to set this, this down. This shit's pitch dark out. We started this shit like three. Dude, we gave Ace Harbor a lot of business. disassembled the lap pull down we thought that we would pretty much set up the entire gym that day but we ended up not doing that because it like got really really late we had to go to Ace Hardware like 12 times so the next day we all went to Philadelphia to see Dylan's girlfriend Kiara we just hung out there for a little bit and we ended up training back there he's got a few clips you guys can see the full thing on Dylan's video so this is the day after this is the day after it is two days after it's two days after so once again, we couldn't finish the whole gym project tonight, but we made a shit ton of progress. So we basically moved a bunch of more mats down and we changed the lights. So I don't know, this is like much more of a cooler temperature and they're like 800 lumens. So they're so much brighter than the previous lights. And the gym just has like so much nicer of a vibe now. Like I just fucking hate like when it's too warm. It's poopy orange lights. Like yeah, it just looks like shit. But anyway, this is like coming like really close to the final product. We just have this squat rack here. This is gonna be a deadlift platform. We're just gonna put extra padding here. The lat pull down, which is the most difficult, annoying thing. And then we have the entire dumbbell rack set here. The hamstring curl quad extension machine over here. The squat rack that was by the, uh, where the deadlift platform is now is gonna be put here. And then we have the cable fly machine here and there's gonna be like a big tapestry drape thing just like covering all that ugly weird shit that goes on there. And yeah, so it's 10.30 right now and I was gonna hit a back workout and do a voiceover to end this video, but I'm not gonna do that because it's really late and me and Dylan, 
We have to wake up tomorrow super early at like Dude, eight. earlier than we've woken up in the last nine years. Yeah, we have to wake up at eight o'clock, which is unfortunately pretty early. You told me nine, dude. We're getting picked up at nine. Shit. What are you gonna? We gotta eat breakfast and shit. I'm getting up. Anyway, we have to leave at nine o'clock because we're going to Doug's house, which is like three hours away. We're all gonna hang out. It's gonna be really fun. So then we'll film like a really epic, really good workout. So yeah, that's why I'm not doing a workout to end this video. But the next video's workout should be really good. And yeah, that's pretty much the gist. I'm gonna edit this video now. Have a big meal. Go to sleep. Wake up tomorrow and hopefully we won't get in a car accident driving to dogs. That's a fucking scary drive. Oh shit! Oh, I, th I think it's dude. Look at that. Wait, dude, I think wait, put that shit back. Dude. It's a white balance. Oh shit! Wait. Oh, you look. You look like Sam Backman right now.